Hi everyone, my name is Chiawani and my matrix number is F1980025. I'm from SBH3. Today, the types of forage that I will talk about is buffer grass. Its scientific name is Sankris series. Buffer grass is a valuable tropical grass cultivated in Africa, Australia, and India. It's a highly variable tufted toxic forming perennial grass from the family Poaceae. Most of the grass grows during summer. It is suited to a range of soils but favors those that are well drained and is better to avoid low fertility soils. It is poor tolerance to water logging. It is also draft resistant. It responds quickly to light rain in all but the coldest months. It is poor tolerance to frost. Moreover, it is also not suited for short term pasture in a cropping rotation. This is because its early growth is slow and is difficult to remove by cultivation. It's only moderately palatable to stock, and pastures dominated by it are unsuitable for horses. Now I will continue with the morphology of buffer grass. First, it has a deep, tough root stalk that may go as deep as 2 meters. Some varieties are rhizomatous. The cones are erect or decumbent reaching up to 2 meters in length. The leaves are linear blades, wings to bluish green, slightly porous, 3 to 30 cm long, and 4 to 10 mm wide. The inflorescence is a spike-like pedicle, bearing deciduous spikelets, which are surrounded by hairy bristles. The seed is an ovoid chaosis, 1.4 to 2 mm long. Next, the nutritive value of rougher grass. The nutritive value of buffer grass is not as high as that of some other improved pasture grasses. Its crude protein values are mostly in the range of 6 to 16 percent, and crude protein digestibility from 50 to 16 percent. It depends on age of growth, cultivar, and soil fertility, which including fertilizer use. The phosphorus levels are usually higher than in other tropical grasses and range from 0.15 to 0.65% in the dry matter. Last but not least, the quality of buffer grass. The qualities of buffer grass are numerous. It's easy to establish and provides comparative high value forage with yields between 2 and 18 tons dry matter per hectare without fertilizer and up to 24 tons per hectare with the addition of a complete fertilizer. It makes reasonable quality hay when cut in the early flowering stage, yielding up to 2.5 tons per hectare per cut. Once the seed has been harvested, all grass can give low quality roughage for dry feeding with supplements. Buffer grass is palatable to stock and once established, it can withstand heavy grazing and trampling. In arid areas, it maintains livestock during drought periods. Some strains also grow well during the wet seasons. It may be a valuable standover feed for winter grazing is supplemented with urea and molasses. In India, the seeds may also be harvested to make bread or eaten raw by humans. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy it.